Live to Michaela Wrench, who joins us live from the scene of the crash with more with what we know so far tonight. Michaela. Yeah, Laura, I'm standing right where the incident occurred earlier this morning. And as you can see, officials have already cleared up the remains of the crash. But if you look closely, you can still see marks engraved in the ground. Your worst day has to be their best day. A St. Louis County school bus was transporting 20 students northbound on Highway 5 to Cherry School when it was T-boned by a white SUV, causing it to roll onto its side into the ditch. Of the 20 students on board, 12 were hurt and 10 were taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. However, the driver of the SUV was airlifted to Essentia Health in Virginia with life-threatening injuries. The school bus was on its side. Apparently, it looked like it had rolled at least one time. Um, there was a number of children that had self-extricated out of the bus. The Hibbing Fire Chief Eric Jankola was on scene Thursday morning. He says they don't get calls for these types of accidents frequently, but when they do, Step 1 is having more resources on scene than potentially needed. We call up the cavalry. We get as many resources coming. We reached out as far as City of Virginia for ambulance services. One of those resources included the St. Louis County Sheriff's Office. With a combination of these medical services, they were able to be more effective on scene. I would say within an hour, all the kids were either transported to the hospital or picked up by parents and all. Um, so it, it was a pretty fluid process. As a father, Lieutenant Jason Akerson says responding to a situation like this must be handled with care. As for the conditions of the bus driver and the woman who hit the bus, we'll continue to check up on them. In the meantime, we'll bring you more information the more we learn. All right, Michaela, live for us from near Cherry tonight. Michaela, thank you. No, we